Can I ask a question? Where should I be looking? Yeah. Can I school? Can I swear? Yeah, <laughs> Squirrels and biscuits. <laughs> Squirrels and biscuits. Yeah. Awesome. I am Rachel Bauman, artist. Oh, I specialize in tattoo art, so or like body art, whatever you want to call it. But some of my favorites are pen and ink. So just like pen and ink on paper or any type of manipulation, I guess. So if I can put paint on something, I'll do it. So that's my that's my favorite. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like if you came to my house, you would realize that because I can't leave anything untouched. Anything that's like regular, like a, if, even if it's just like um, say like you bought like a little like mirror at Walmart, I would have to put glitter all over it or something like that. So any type of medium, if I can stick shit on shit, I'll put it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Feathers, fringe, faux fur. It's all good. What does fringe mean? Fringe, uh, fringe, so like fringe. Anything that like hangs and dangles like that. This is fringe. Um, or some more fringe, fringe. Fringe, yeah, yeah. Awesome. So I started tattooing, and I don't know the exact date, but it probably, it was around seven or eight years ago. That's when I started. I was like 17 turning 18 at the time. Okay, was yeah. that nerve wracking? Yeah, totally. So it was so it's like it's it's a whole nother medium. Like a lot of people have this idea of like tattooing, like it's it's very much like drawing or painting, but it's not. It's very similar. Like you need to have artistic talent, but it's so different in like the skills that you need to learn. So super nerve wracking, especially because you're tattooing like your friends and your family to start. Yeah, it was fucking scary. <laughs> the F word's like my favorite word. Yeah. <laughs> have you tattooed yourself? Yes. Yes, I have only, um, I did once without any pigment and then another time on my thigh, which was like super funny. I wish I could show you, but it's like this cool hand image. I didn't ever finish it because it hurts too much, but yeah, yeah, it's a super liberating experience tattooing yourself because you're the one in control and you're actually doing it. It's very different than someone else. Okay. What is a memorable tattoo that you've given to somebody? It's a hard one. Just because it's, it's hard because I love what I do, so every experience is a little, it's like a little memory. Most memorable though, I guess a memorable one would be of a client, Brandon, who has passed on now, but he was 17 getting his first tattoo and he had planned it out to get this like super cool quote on his arm, like in, in between treatments and stuff like that. And his whole family came in to watch and because you don't, sometimes you get so caught up in your job and what you do that you forget about like how special moments can be, right? So like when it's like stuff like that, when you're like, okay, I'm, I'm doing this for someone for a specific reason, that's that's memorable, I guess. Life in general like inspires me even when it gets a little like scary at times. And that's like what I want to take with my artwork instead of it just being like a very like, sh even though it's sometimes a very short interaction, like I want to like, I, I want to take it to the next level where it is like a, about connection and it is about taking that art and making it something like even more than it is. It's hard to explain, but that's what I really want to do because it's so special. What do you want me to say again? Just say, uh, thanks for watching, I'm Rachel. Cool, um, this is Rachel Bauman. I work at Neo Primitive Tattoo and you're watching Cahoots Entertainment. <laughs> yeah. That's great. That's yeah. That was really good. Okay. <laughs>